This is Nisi P, and we are back with Miss Dolores Givens, and she has been telling us about these mules that she's got. And so I need to know, are they all over St. P? Well, so far, there it's on um they installed it at um Lake Vista Recreation today. Okay. A foot wall by seven feet high. Um Academy Prep approved it. They just didn't give me an installation date. Okay. I'm trying to get it into um Charles Park. And um, my goal is to install this mural in every county. Oh. In, in, in Hillsborough County, Sarasota, each county, I want to have maybe um, one or two murals. Okay. That's my goal. Okay. So could you tell me what the process is? I mean, how did you go about, uh, like you said, you went to the city. So how do you go about doing something like that? I mean, are there like codes or... or different things that you have to, cause see, I don't know. I, I can't draw. No, anyway, there's, there's so. no, um, excuse me. There's no specific um, program or no specific way that you, um, that you approach somebody. I'm just very friendly. So I'm not afraid to ask questions. I'm not afraid to ask people what I want. Okay. So and you I'm, just went to the city and say, I have this great idea for this mural and I would really like to put this in X, Y, Z places. And and they said, okay? Yes, ma'am. At the beginning, they didn't say, okay. <laughs> so, at the very beginning, they didn't say, okay. But I had to um, do my research and talk to people and ask people to support me and um, get letters and everything until they said yes. Well, I... You know, I support you from day one that we met. It was like, oh, she is so amazing. This is so cool. So, again, you are going to be um, Saturday, March the 18th yes. at the Lake Vista Recreational Center. Can you tell me where that is? Like, the, do you have the address for that? It's on the flyer there. I don't have it offhand. It's at the bottom of the flyer, but I can get one. Okay. Um, I it's at don't. The bottom. 67th okay. Avenue South. 67th Avenue South? 62nd. If you wait, oh my God, I don't have. Because I don't, I don't have. Okay, wait a minute. Um. Okay, let me see if I can look it up right quick. It should be on one of these. I am so excited for you. I am so happy for me. I was there this morning while they were installing it. Uh-huh. And um, while they were installing it, I was almost talking to myself. <laughs> Why? <laughs> they, they put it up at, um, I'll get it in a minute. They put it up at six o'clock this morning, at seven o'clock. Okay. And um, while they were putting it up, uh -huh. what I was saying to myself was, um, oh okay, my I found the address. Okay. It is Lake Vista Recreational Center. 1401 62nd Avenue South in St. Petersburg. Yes. Okay. So let me ask you a question. Is this a painting? This is a painting, right? No, it's going to go, go up like wallpaper. Oh, so how did you do that? I mean, how did you get, if you've got a seven foot wall or six foot wall, how did you do that? I had to find a company that would do it. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. so, it's okay. Up, it's up, so it looks like a painting on the wall. This is so exciting. It's, really it's amazing because when I was sitting there this morning and I was looking at it, I don't know if, if you, you yourself or any person who've done something so spectacular, this is really a, 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 a um, historical event because it's never been done. Right. So That's right. I, I'm really making history. <laughs> yes, you are. And you are June, definitely doing that. Yep. And in June, I'll be 70, 74 years old. Really? And I feel so amazed. I feel so amazing. I feel that um, the more kids I can help and more adults I can help, I um, it just melts my heart to know that I can and will be putting an impact on our society. Yes. Because yes. we need that. We need that. We need our children to stand up. We need our children to be proud. 
we need our children to know that they are a great people. And they need and they need to know that they need to be celebrated. They never again need to put their heads down or say, I'm not good as good as you, or be envious of somebody else who has a little bit more than them. Right. Because they have everything they need right up here. And if and if they and, and with this, um to, to get all the people to recognize it. And if all the people recognize these inventions. They can't communicate with their children saying, no, 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 no. You see all these people? Right. A lot of these people didn't have educations. A lot of these people are slaves. Yeah. A lot of these people didn't go to school, period. And look what they did. This is so amazing. You know, I and I, I tell people, I said, listen, we were slaves. We had all the time in the world. <laughs> <laughs> to think about something really great. I was joking about that, but I mean... No, no, I, I told you guys, this is, she is amazing. Um, and this is quite a feat, um, to be able to do that and share that information with mm -hmm. not just the children, but the community itself, the community, just the right. community itself. Mm -hmm. This is, this is a very awesome feat. I congratulate you, Miss Dolores. Thank you. I, I, I get to call her Miss Dante because that's her nickname. I'm going to call her Miss Dante. And but... I'll tell you what that means. Okay. D O N T E means, uh -huh. means don't overlook nationally talented entrepreneurs. I like that. I like that. I'm gonna have to make up an acronym for my name. I can't figure it out though, but you will. I will. Yeah, if I think about it for. But I I love that. That is so awesome. That is yeah, so I cool. I want to say one more thing. I want I don't I want anybody who sees this to always know uh -huh. that anything you think about developing creating can come to fruition yes anything you think about can come to fruition you have to do your homework it might let me just tell you something my dad uh -huh. i'm from new york and my dad and my mom but my dad was my hero okay he would, he would um do beauty pageants he was a advertising printer okay he would do beauty pageants he did um like four or five veterans parades in, in New York. He would do these large um, events while he was working. Daddy would actually go to work every day, come uh -huh. home, go into his office and work on his project. And I loved him so much. One year um, while he gave one of his, um, the veterans parades. Okay. I was going through his dresser for something. And I found these envelopes. And these envelopes had all kinds of proclamations in them. He had uh, plaques and awards, about about 38 of them. So me wow. and my brother, we framed them all uh -huh. um, before he got home from the parade with everybody. Uh-huh. invited everybody over. And we put the, the uh, plaques everywhere in the living room. Yeah. And, and I made a plaque for him, thanking him for being my father. Because I was oh. so grateful for him. And, and he didn't. He, let me tell you something. My dad could have said the sky is, is purple and green. I'd say, well, my father is purple and green. You better believe it. <laughs> so that's, how, that's what a positive person he was. Yeah. You see, so I'm really blessed in a whole lot of ways, you know? Yeah. Well, you, you obviously, you got that from him with doing what you're doing. So, yeah. And my, yeah. My, my mom was a seamstress and my brother was an artist. Oh, you had, hey, you're across the board with that talent. Mm -hmm. I, I, I thank God for that. Yes. Well, Mr. Lewis, thank you so much for joining ECP. Um, I really appreciate you taking the time to talk to me about what you're doing. I am so proud of you. Thank and you, I congratulate you on, on everything that you're doing. So you. your next mural, you're going to come back and tell us about that one, right? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. We are going to have that. Thank you again, Ms. Dolores. And I am going to do my best to be there. Um, yes. I, I am going to try really hard to be there. Yes, um, and I, I, I asked the community to be there for my support and to support each other. Yes. To see the mural and see what kind of education they can get from it. Mm -hmm. Oh, tr for sure. For, for sure. Because, I, I mean, I'm just talking to you just these few minutes. I've learned quite a bit. Uh, from you so i i am really excited for you and like i said i'm going to do my best to be there and so everybody i'm going to tell you again it is saturday march 18th 
at the Lake Vista Recreational Center, which is at 1401 62nd Avenue South in St. Petersburg. And if they okay. want to, they can look at my um my daycare with my homeschool, which is Butterfly Village Kids College. Okay. So is that the is that how we would reach you and get in touch with you? Say that if I decide I want to put a mural up on my wall, is is that how I would reach you? Oh, um, I'm trying to figure out if I oh, my email is Butterfly Village Kids College at mail.com. Okay. Okay. So there you have it. You guys, if you want a mirror on your wall, just this is the lady to call. This is the lady to call. Thank, Thank you again, you. Mr. Lawrence. And I, I wish you all the luck. And again, I want to congratulate you on what you're doing for you, the kids, and the community. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for having me. I really appreciate that. Oh, no problem. This has been Nisi P of Nisi P Entertainment. Back to you in the studio.